Welcome back to this series of Black Hat Executive Spotlights. Terry Sweeney here with Black Hat. And joining me now is Anita D'Amico, VP of Products for Synopsys. Anita, thanks for joining us today. My pleasure, Terry. Well, we of course are here to talk about uh, application security orchestration and correlation, um, mm -hmm. AKA ASOC or ASOC. Um, Tell us a bit more about what ASOC is and what's generating all the buzz around it. Well, let's talk about ASOC. First, let's define it. It stands for Application Security Orchestration and Correlation. And the hype is about the automation and how much time it saves. In fact, what an ASOC system typically does is that it automates some of the most labor intensive aspects of application security. So let's take it apart. The first piece is orchestration. So what that means is that an ASOC solution will automatically configure and run the security testing tools that you need to run on your software. Now, there sometimes it follows a policy prescription and will even select the types of tools to be run. Other times you can just ask it to run the tools, but it will automatically configure and run the tools for you. So that's the orchestration piece. The second piece is correlation. Now, when you run a lot of different testing techniques on your software, you're going to come out with possibly thousands of issues. There's gonna be a lot of false positives in there. Uh, there's gonna be some duplicates in there. One of the incredible benefits of an ASOC solution is that it correlates the results of all of those different testing techniques. It takes those thousands of issues and it says, these ones over here from this testing tool are the same as these over here from this testing tool. Now by correlating them, you can get rid of the duplicates. So the second benefit of an ASOC system is that it does correlation and deduplication. And what you get out of that is a single unified set of results. The third thing that is very valuable about an ASOC system is prioritization. A good ASOC system will take that unified set of results and will rack and stack them based on what the most important things are to fix first using your enterprise policy. So that's a lot to be hyped about. I dare say, um, it sounds like uh, another uh, maybe implicit benefit is that it helps these, ap these applications get to market faster or get to production faster. Anything that you can do to speed up the security in, in a software production is going to help it get to market faster. You bet. AppSec has historically had trouble keeping up with, with DevOps practices. Um, it seems as if ASOC is helping to, to bust up that narrative a bit. Um, explain how ASOC helps improve um, DevSecOps efficiency. Well, efficiency and speed are one of the major reasons why people adopt an ASOC solution. So. First of all, that automation that I talked about, it automates the most labor intensive aspects of securing your software. And that is efficient in and of itself. And then the prioritization is very important. It can take up to 10 minutes to triage each issue that a, a security testing tool finds. And nobody has time to do that for thousands of issues. So what a good ASOC system has is machine learning built into it that will learn what are your enterprise policies for considering something to be escalated versus something to be left on the cutting room floor? And so what a good ASOC system does is automatically prioritize the issues to be escalated or to be ignored. And then finally, a, an ASOC system will fit right into your build pipeline. So the developer is comfortable with it, it's right within the developer's tooling, and the developer never has to leave his or her environment in order to secure the code. Thanks, that's, that's actually additional helpful context. Um, another piece of this seems to be um, that, well, it's around accountability, which has been um, historically uh, quite, a, quite a hurdle in, in the world of AppSec. Um, how is at ASOC improving AppSec accountability? Can you, can you explain that a bit more? Sure. Well, first of all, let's talk about the importance of accountability. 
uh, it's not enough to just secure your software. You have to prove it. You have to attest mm -hmm. to it. And when if you actually have a breach, people are going to come in and say to you, what did you do? What tests did you run? What was found? And did you fix them? And what a good ASOC system does is it serves as your system of record. So it, because it orchestrates the tools or it takes the results of tools that you've run and brought them into an aggregated set, the ASOC system already knows what tests were run and when they were run on your software project. The second thing that it does is it knows what you found. It knows all the issues that were found, which ones were deemed critical, and which ones were sent for escalation and remediation. And because an ASOC system will hook right into your issue tracking system, it tracks the remediation process. So it knows when the tests were run, it knows what was found, and it knows whether or not it was fixed. And that's really what you need in order to demonstrate accountability. And that's what an application security orchestration and correlation system delivers. Great stuff, Anita. Thank you for uh, walking us through the, the intricacies of, uh, of ASOC. Uh, great insights on getting uh, applications to be better, faster, and most importantly, more secure. Appreciate you joining us on this Black Hat Executive Spotlight today. My pleasure, Terry. We've been talking with Anita D'Amico, Vice President of Products with Synopsys. This has been Terry Sweeney for Black Hat. Thanks for joining us for this Black Hat Executive Spotlight Series. See you next time.